Hey guys, welcome back to Daniel's Tech Reviews, Phone Collection and Repair. Today, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to set up an iPod Touch 4th generation in 2022. So, guys, um, it does require a Wi-Fi connection, so um, step one, you have to get an iPhone running on iOS 14 or lower, like... Um, the iPhone 12 or the iPhone 11 or lower that's running on iOS 12 and lower like probably much pretty much down to iOS 5 where they support internet connections so um, yeah so iOS 15 is not supported but due to Apple switching the Wi-Fi networks around and at and um, Apple AD somewhat sometimes sign in on this um, iPod but um, Apple is trying to obviously shut down the iOS 6 internet connection, but yeah, I've already connected to my Wi-Fi. I'm currently using my um, iPad mini third generation as my Wi-Fi device for this video. I am recording on my iPhone 13 Pro. Um, so yeah, so I'm gonna hit next. Um, we're gonna wait for the activation. So this, um, enable location services. So I'm gonna hit next. Um, restore from, yeah, you can see, restore from backup, don't transfer apps or data, you can choose any of these options, um, but for now I'm going to hit next, Apple ID, um, you could set up one if you want, but I'm not going to set up, I'm going to set up later, I'm going to choose set up later in settings, oh, whoops, I kept on hitting the wrong thing, set up, where's set up later in settings? There we go. Set up later in settings. Terms and conditions. You must agree to them. Um, I just wish that um, this iPod had Siri. Share with Apple. Welcome to iPod Touch. And now we're going to get started. So you can see right here, we are now fully set up on iOS 6. I'm going to check the... Um, Check the settings, general, about, um, we're going to see what software version we're running. Um, Swiss software version, ooh, um, 6.1.6, 10B500. Um, so yeah, you can see right here, it's running on iOS um, 6, 1, 6, 10B500. Um, I'm not sure what gigabytes this is. I'm going to have to read it later on voiceover. But yeah, guys, this is how to set up an iPod Touch 4th generation in 2022. You're going to have to hurry up and if you have an old iPod Touch 4th generation lying around, just factory reset. Um, do set it up right now before Apple shuts down, you know, the network service. But yeah, I've got a bunch of 4th generations just lying around, just factory reset, and I'm going to set them all up. And probably put music on them through a computer. But yeah guys, thank you guys for watching. Comment, like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, bye now.